When I first heard the word biometrics, I had no idea what they were talking about. I mean, bio is short for biography, as well as a prefix associated with life. And metrics deals with measuring things. Biometrics are those characteristics of the human body that make each one of us uniquely identifiable. They include things like fingerprints, iris scans, and facial images. Driving force behind pushing this technology forward is the war on terror. Biometrics are being captured in theater daily by many different military teams. So biometrics are the cool technologies we see in spy movies and on TV. But in the movies, these technologies are deployed in high-tech banks and futuristic building complexes. Soldiers are collecting biometrics in the field. The Navy approached Southwest Research Institute to help them further their capability in biometric data collection. At the time, they were using a system that was very large and very heavy and very difficult for them to use in the environment that they operate in, the maritime environment. It weighed around 75 pounds. Each individual biometric sensor was separate and had to be controlled separately. The system that we developed for the Navy was a single handheld system that was all integrated. All the biometric sensors were integrated into one package and integrated with a, a ultra mobile PC. The second generation of that prototype became smaller than a standard laptop, weighing about five pounds. In addition to weighing only a fraction of the original system and operating reliably in harsh environments, the new system holds up to 200,000 biometric enrollments. The system that we designed, because it could store such a large database on board, was a real time saver for the teams that were using it because it allowed them in real time to match up against a known database of terrorism suspects without having to wait days, sometimes weeks, to get answers back. The compact and lightweight systems we developed for the Navy allowed them to operate their mission much more effectively and efficiently and reduce the time that they had to spend in dangerous situations. SWRI is continuing to create new applications, including this kiosk biometric enrollment station which collects slap and rolled fingerprints, iris images, and five facial poses to allow checkpoint personnel to screen and vet persons seeking access to sensitive areas. The kiosk has user-friendly interface software and integrated components for easy maintenance.